possible causes to reduction in egg production among the Philippine native chicken. The reduction in egg production among native chickens is a pressing issue with significant implications for food security, local economies, and the sustainability of poultry farming. As we delve into the reasons behind this decline, it becomes clear that environmental, genetic, management, and socioeconomic factors are at play. Understanding these elements is crucial for stakeholders aiming to revitalize native chicken populations and ensure their continued contribution to agricultural diversity and rural livelihoods. Environmental Factors One of the most significant contributors to the decline in egg production among native chickens is the changing environmental landscape. Climate change has introduced unpredictable weather patterns, leading to extreme temperatures and altered rainfall patterns. Native chickens, often less resilient than commercial breeds, struggle to adapt to these shifts. High temperatures can stress birds, leading to reduced feed intake and lower egg production. Furthermore, prolonged droughts can affect the availability of natural forage, which is essential for the health and well-being of these chickens. In addition to climate change, habitat destruction poses a severe threat to native chicken populations. Urban expansion, deforestation, and agricultural intensification have led to the loss of natural habitats where these birds thrive. The reduction in space not only limits their foraging opportunities, but also increases competition for resources, further exacerbating the decline in egg production. As native chickens are often raised in free-range systems, their ability to roam and forage is crucial for their overall health and productivity. When their environment is compromised, so too is their capacity to lay eggs. Genetic Factors The genetic makeup of native chickens plays a pivotal role in their egg-laying capabilities. Unlike commercial breeds that have been selectively bred for high productivity, native chickens often possess traits that prioritize survival over prolific egg production. This genetic predisposition can result in lower egg yields compared to their commercial counterparts. While native breeds are often more resilient to local diseases and harsh conditions, this resilience comes at the cost of reduced egg-laying potential. Moreover, the lack of genetic diversity within native chicken populations can lead to inbreeding, which further diminishes their reproductive performance. Inbreeding can result in weakened immune systems and lower fertility rates, compounding the issue of declining egg production. To address this challenge, it is essential to implement breeding programs that focus on enhancing both productivity and genetic diversity. By doing so, we can ensure that native chickens not only survive but thrive in their environments. Management Practices Management practices significantly influence the productivity of native chickens. Many smallholder farmers who raise these birds often lack access to modern poultry management techniques and resources. Traditional practices may not provide optimal nutrition or housing conditions necessary for maximizing egg production. For instance, Inadequate feeding strategies can lead to nutritional deficiencies that directly impact the bird's ability to lay eggs. Additionally, biosecurity measures are often overlooked in small-scale poultry operations. Without proper disease management protocols, native chickens are susceptible to infections that can drastically reduce egg production. Diseases such as Newcastle disease or avian influenza can spread rapidly among flocks leading to significant losses in both egg yield and overall flock health. Educating farmers about effective management practices and providing them with the necessary resources can help mitigate these issues and improve egg production rates. Socioeconomic Challenges The socioeconomic landscape surrounding poultry farming also plays a crucial role in the decline of egg production among native chickens. Many smallholder farmers face economic constraints that limit their ability to invest in better management practices or quality feed. The rising cost of inputs combined with fluctuating market prices can discourage farmers from maintaining or expanding their flocks. This economic pressure often leads to a focus on short-term survival 
rather than long-term sustainability. Furthermore, the lack of access to markets for native chicken products can disincentivize farmers from investing in their flocks. If farmers cannot sell their eggs at a fair price or face stiff competition from commercial poultry operations, they may choose to reduce their flock sizes or even abandon poultry farming altogether. Strengthening market access for native chicken products and promoting their unique qualities can help create a more favorable economic environment for smallholder farmers. In conclusion, the reduction in egg production among native chickens is a multifaceted issue that requires a comprehensive understanding of environmental, genetic management, and socioeconomic factors. By addressing these challenges through targeted interventions, such as improving breeding practices, enhancing management techniques, and supporting farmers economically, we can revitalize native chicken populations and ensure they continue to play a vital role in sustainable agriculture. It is imperative that we recognize the value of these birds not only as a source of food, but also as a cornerstone of cultural heritage and biodiversity. Through concerted efforts, we can turn the tide on declining egg production and secure a brighter future for native chickens and the communities that depend on them.